I'm going to show you how to set up item level security in SharePoint Online. This is typically done if you want to make sure that users can only see the items that they have created themselves. Now site owners can still see everything, so you could use this unique situation to create a system where maybe employees will send timesheets to their managers. The manager can see all the timesheets, but each employee can only see what they have uploaded themselves. There used to be an easy option to set this in library settings, but with SharePoint Online, the option is hidden altogether. I'm going to show you how to do this through PowerShell. We'll start by launching PowerShell as administrator. Uh, you're going to need PNP PowerShell as well. This is a PowerShell extension that you could download if you don't already have it. And if you're a new SharePoint admin, trust me, you'll end up using this a lot. And if you're getting value out of this, uh, do me a favor and click that like button to let me know. And I would appreciate that. So the first thing we're going to do is connect to our SharePoint environment with this command. And obviously you would substitute this URL for your own site. Then we're going to get a reference to the list that we're going to be updating, or in this case, it's a library. So this line will give us a variable that represents the library we're going to update. Then we're going to set read security to two and write security to two. Then we're going to queue up an update to make the settings take effect and then execute the whole thing to update our live environment. And that's it. Our library is updated. Users can only see and update their own items. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to the channel for more content like this.